the UK and EU could go back to the beginning and try for a Brexit trade deal again if one is not agreed before the transition period ends on December 31st. Liam Fox says, a Brexit deal would give a major boost to global confidence in the aftermath of the coronavirus pandemic, the former international trade secretary said, as he added he was hopeful one would be struck. He said a deal between Britain and the European Union could have a major impact on the hailing global economy. Speaking to Sky News, Dr. Fox said, I still think that a Brexit deal is entirely possible. Not only do I think it's in the interests of both the UK and the EU but in the global circumstances that we face today, we need a boost in confidence. And I think that both parties could make a big contribution to that global confidence by coming to an agreement. Dr. Fox, who formerly served as International Trade Secretary, also pointed out talks between London and Brussels would not come to an end should the Brexit negotiations conclude in a no-deal scenario. The former frontbencher insisted talks with the bloc would still have to resume in the coming months to ensure a tentative trade agreement is in place to avoid major disruption to businesses. Dr. Fox continued, let's face it, even if we don't get this agreement now, we would have to start again to get to one in the future because it's in the interests of both parties. That's usually the basis for a trade agreement. Asked whether continuing to negotiate would cause a postponement of the Brexit transition deadlines, Dr. Fox said, I still think we will get an agreement. I think there are such strong interests on both sides to get it, it is doable if the political will is there. It seems the differences in things like fishing or state aid can be managed, we can get over that. The thing we heard nothing at all is a sign that the intensity of the negotiations has increased, negotiations with the EU had to be moved online after one of the participating officials caught the coronavirus and had to be isolated. In a bid to appease the EU side, British negotiator Lord Frost offered a review clause on any fishing deal after three to five years. But Brussels rejected the proposal, requesting any review takes place after 10 to 15 years after an agreement on the future of fisheries is agreed. A source said, they still don't get it. They are still demanding basically 80% of the access they have now to UK waters and are sticking to that demand. 